On behalf of Kevin Peterson, uh, Director of the Dryden Flight Research Center, I'd like to welcome all of you to the debut of the Sophia Astronomical Observatory aircraft. This aircraft This aircraft, the Clipper Lindbergh, was dedicated by Ann Morrow Lindbergh 30 years ago when it entered service with Pan American Air Airways. Now, after extensive modification for the SOFIA program, this aircraft is about to begin flight testing for its new science mission. The 747 Clipper Lindbergh behind us is embarking on a new career, too, as one of the world's great science ob observatories. The plane is obviously a big one. Uh, seeing it in person gives you an appreciation for the size of the activity that we're involved with. And the challenges ahead of us yet are also very large as we complete the development and the flight test activities over the next couple of years here at, uh, at NASA Dryden. I truly believe that we are but in our infancy in terms of expanding and exploring the human potential. We are just a blip on the history of time. This represents a fantastic step, one that I hope will bring us into the future and will allow us to understand and thrive and survive, keep this home planet alive a little bit longer until we can find another one out there that we can live on. That is, is critical, and this mission is, is absolutely fantastic. That's why I'm here today because it gives me the juice to see this happening right now, to understand how many people and how many researchers are going to be affected by this and how many of their students, how big of a, of a broadcast effect this is going to have at lighting, up, lighting us up, at giving us the juice to figure out how to get there, how to get there, how to get to the future, how to get out into space on a more permanent basis, and, and um, so that our kids and our children's children can thrive and survive into the future. Thank you very much. Please join me in giving Mr. Lindbergh a countdown. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, Lindbergh. <laughs>